Hey, what's going on my friends? Bazi Hassan here and welcome back to the community. And in this lesson, I'm going to actually walk you guys through some ninja strategies on exactly how to reverse engineer your competition um, on Facebook ads. Because I know you guys, um, I've shown you guys PPV spy tools and, and things of that nature, but it's really hard to spy when it comes to Facebook ads because there's, there's not tools that give you the full solution. There's tools that kind of show you ads and templates but they don't teach you the targeting and what people are targeting so i'm going to walk you guys through some really ninja strategies okay so let's just hop on my browser and right now i'm logged on my facebook profile if you guys ain't added me yet make sure you add me let's be friends bazi hassan i've got actually two profiles bazi hassan one and bazi hassan two but if you just search bazi hassan on the graph <coughs> graph search you should see my name okay so right now what i'm going to do is show you guys a ninja super ninja strategy you guys ready for it okay let's get it okay so can you see these ads that have been displayed to me on the right hand field okay you can see this ad by salesseek.net you can see this ad by uh, start fashion career i'm going to show you guys exactly how you know i want to know why why are these ads being displayed to me right so when you hover over the ad you should see this little x button here can you see this little x button here just have to zoom in there for you guys and it's, it's on every ad okay so let me just zoom out if i click this button what's going to happen is you see a lot of selections hide ad why am i seeing this this ad is useful we're interested in this why am i seeing this ad okay so if we click that look what happens guys look what happens we get some juicy data okay so we get the fan page <coughs> of the advertiser. We also get this, okay? As you can see, one of the reasons you're seeing this ad is being is because London College of Contemporary, sorry if I can't read guys, <laughs> um, wants to reach people aged 18 to 35 near London that are interested in for photography. So guys, we're seeing these people's tar targeting like for Facebook, we're seeing the targeting. This is what they're targeting, guys. The target you can see exactly what age, what location, and targeting. Okay, so you can see they want people that are 18 to 35 near London interested in photography. Okay, um, so that's just one example. Now I can show you guys a more, more, more examples and, and show you some advanced things. Okay, so let's click this ad. Why am I seeing this ad by my online mentor? Okay, so. One of the reasons you're seeing this ad is because my online mentor wants to reach people aged 18 and older near London, England, who have visited their website or used one of their apps. Okay, so what this means is I'm being retargeted. This person is retargeting. This is the ad that's retargeting. Okay, so that's what that means basically. When you see this, you have visited their website or used one of their apps, and you see that you don't see no interests whatsoever. That means that person's you're targeting me okay so let's close that let's go into the main newsfeed and let's find some more ads so let's click this why am i seeing ad door okay so somewhere here you should see a, a drop down menu why am i seeing this okay so this is this is gets a bit more ninja um ad raw wants to reach people that are 22 to 55 in, in the united kingdom who are similar to their customers we think you're similar based on what you do on facebook and pages you like so what these people are doing guys is they're using facebook's custom audience look-alike audience okay so they're possibly targeting people who like their page and going for people who like their page and are very similar to their fans on their page okay so you can see that's are you guys starting to see the bigger picture here? okay um, just by doing some ground foundation research, you can avoid a lot of mistakes and basically just, you know, kind of get that, start your campaigns in the right direction from the start. Okay. So let's go down and let's keep searching for some more newsfeed ads. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. This okay, I think that yeah, this is an ad. So whenever you see sponsored, that means that's an ad. 
So um, this is some campaign planner kind of ad per percolate. Never heard of them. So let's see why am I being targeted for this? Okay, so as you can see, percolate wants to reach people aged 24 to 64 in the United Kingdom interested in marketing. Simple, very simple targeting. So now, now guys, I'm gonna take you up a notch, okay? So do you want this? Do you want this strategy to work very, very well for you? Let me show you guys a very good tactic. Um, in your niche, whatever offer you're promoting, go find the best leaders or you know the brands or whatever it is, find their fan pages and start to like them. Start to like their fan pages. Why? Because you're gonna start to get displayed their ads and then you can start reverse engineering their targeting methods and once you start to understand what age groups what countries um, what interests they're going for then you could just basically copy their targeting and you know kind of just reverse engineer make a different kind of ad and you should do very very well guys very well okay so this is reverse engineering I'm not gonna leave it there guys I do have an extra 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 um, lesson that I'm gonna follow up with I'm going to show you guys another tool that I use when it comes to reverse engineering Facebook ads. So look out for part two, okay? So guys, go go and um, practice the skill. Go log onto your Facebook, start to reverse engineer some ads, and uh, yeah, just you know note it down. Make sure that you you know you put this onto your market research and methods. Um, yeah, guys. So I look forward to helping you even more, <laughs> much more value coming. And um, yeah, we we catch up soon. Take care.